In December 1919, the squad received intelligence that Lord Lieutenant of Ireland John French was to be travelling from Roscommon to Ashtown train station in Dublin. On the 19th of December, the squad, alongside the Big Four, Dan Breen, Seamus Robinson, Sean Tracy and Sean Hogan, made their way to Ashtown on bicycles. They sat in Kelly's pub while they waited for Lord French to arrive. When they received signal that Lord French had arrived at the train station, they left the pub. Dan Breen, Martin Savage and Tom Keogh grabbed a cart and tried to push it out in the middle of the road to block the two-car convoy. The cart was much heavier than they expected and they struggled to push it out into the middle of the road on time. They also started getting hassled from an RIC policeman who Dan Breen told off. This this delay allowed the first car to get through the blockage and little did the IRA know that Lord French was actually in that first car but they expected him to be in the second car. During the fight when the second car came into the area Martin Savage was shot and he ended up dying in Dan Breen's arms. And Dan Breen himself then took a bullet in his leg. The IRA successfully ambushed the second car however there was no Lord French in it and all the car had was some luggage. They let the driver go and they told him we do not shoot prisoners.